Today, I'm going to teach you how to check the rectifier bridge and the vector bridge of a vector is normal. Since the vector I have is of 7.5 kW and the negative terminal of DC bus of small type is not displaced outside, the first thing we need to do is to take apart the shell. If the vector is of large size, this step is not necessary. After disassembling the shell, we must first find the positive and negative terminal of the vector. After finding the positive and negative terminal, let's test the vector rectifier bridge first. Pass the multimeter to the positions of the diode, connect the black test lead to the positive nectar, ne uh, terminal, and then use the red test lead to make sure the R, S, and T terminal in sequence. It is normal if the measure value are all around the 0 0.5. 0 0.5. Then connect the red test lead to the negative terminal and then use the black test lead to make sure the three terminals are S and T in turn. If the stand measurement uh, 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 if the stand measurement value are uh, all the stand, it is normal. The method of measuring the vector bridge is similar to the method of measuring the reactive bridge. Connect the black test lead to the positive terminal and then use the red test lead to make sure the U, V, W, 3 terminal in turn. It is normal if the measured values are all around 0 0.47. Then connect the red test lead to the negative ter terminal and then use the black black test lead to make sure the UVW three terminals in turn. It is normal if the stem measure value is around 0 0.65. 